Care to share your race, ethnicity, or nationality? <laughs> oh, I'm Haitian. Haitian, I'm Haitian American, you might as well say. I'm a Zoe. We call them Zoes down there in Miami. We Zoes. Or, or we call them ZBs. Zo boy. You hear me? And what does that mean? Zo boy? Yeah. You're a Zoe. You're a Zoe. Like, if they, it's like a thing in Miami. Like, you, you, if you look a certain type of way, you can be from Alaska. You black with dreads. You know, one of them, you know, the natives around Miami going to be like, yo, Zo. You'll look like, what, what you call me? Zo is like, you know. It's, it's a Haitian term, but it's like, that's what we call them. We Zoes, you feel me? And what is the main language you speak at this point? I speak English, but I speak Creole also. And how were you able to pick that up? Uh, my parents, my parents never sat me down and like made me go to class or nothing for it. It was just picking up on context clues. Like even if you hear it, like they would speak like English Creole with me. So he'd be like, yo, Marvin, go get the da-da-da in Creole. And I'd be like, okay, that's what that means. Or this what this means. So like now I speak fluent Creole from just hearing my parents talk to me like that. Do you understand it better than you speak it? Or are you even? Um, I understand it a little bit better. I might get tongue-tied because it's like, you know, it's more, it's, it's just like hard to like to switch it up. But I could survive. You throw me in Haiti? Oh, I'm going to survive. I know we'll tell them what type of food I like, where we finna eat, where we finna go, if I need clothes, if I need shoes, socks, like the, the essentials, yeah, but like a deep, the same time I have like a a, 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 a talk about a, a soccer game, I wouldn't know what to say, but the essentials, the basics, yeah, I got that. Have you had a chance to visit? Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, the last time I visited was, shit, it's been a while, I ain't gonna lie. I was th like three, four years old when I went. I was like three, four years old. I want to go back, but I ain't in a rush to go back because it's like, it's a lot going on. I don't want to go experience like you know my culture in a bad way. I rather you know you know a lot of the infrastructure get filled, fixed and stuff because you know since that that earthquake and like back in the days like yo it's, it's bad. I lost family members and all during that earthquake you know. So I rather rather go and and it's, it's not like and, and the funny thing about it, Haiti I, I still would go because Haiti literally had the lowest COVID rate of all the world like. And we don't even have like medical supplies and stuff like that. But you telling me people that don't have the essentials for like hospital stuff, not even get sick type thing. Like that, that was that's like major. But I still want to go. I gotta go though. Soon I'm gonna go soon. Ever incorporate Creole in your music? Oh yeah, I be throwing a little something in there. But it that and I don't want to do it too much because you want it to be broader. You don't want people, you know, scratching your head. If I make something for the hood, yeah, I'ma talk that shit, but it's not mainly probably for like mainstream shit, like, but you don't want to confuse people that don't know what you're saying. But they'll pick up eventually sometimes. Has there been thought to do a entire song in Creole? Oh, uh, nah, I ain't that good. Uh-uh. <laughs> I ain't that good in Creole, hell no. Ever dated someone that spoke Creole? Yeah, I dated a Haitian girl before. I dated a Haitian girl few times, but I ain't gonna lie, me personally, I don't even, nothing against my Haitian women. I, that's just something I grew up with. Like I had a lot of, I got sisters and aunties and cousins that were Haitian girls. It's like, that's not something I wanna, you feel me? I was just, I've been around it too long, so that's not what I prefer now. When you have dated a Haitian female, what's the longest one of those relationships has lasted? Not long. Cause you you not long at all. Cause you start feeling like you're talking to a relative. It's too close to your culture. You know what I'm saying? You want something outside of your. Nothing against it though, but it's just when you want something new, like you know, something different. Yeah, that's just about it. Any of those females that you've dated in the past that spoke Creole, was it ever their main language, or was it like you, another language? Nah, one of them aside had, from one the of them was like that's their main language. They were like born in Haiti and came here like at a young age type shit like. They still had like a heavy Haitian accent when they speak English type thing. And that shit turned me off. <laughs> I can't do it.